Hi, so today I'm going to show you how to make a basic bechamel sauce and then we're going to turn it into a cheese sauce. So always make sure that you've got your ingredients and your utensils ready. So today all we need is a pan, a whisk and a measuring jug for your milk. So today we've got 50 grams of butter, four tablespoons of plain flour, and 500 mils of milk. Then to make it a cheese sauce, we've got 100 grams of grated cheese. And just to give it a little bit of extra flavor, I've got a teaspoonful of mustard powder. If you don't have mustard powder, you can just Already, you can just add the already pre-mixed mustard that you get in a jar. So, first of all, I'm going to pop my heat on. And I'm going to add the butter to my pan. So I'm just going to let the butter melt. As just about melted now. So just give it a little stir and into that I'm going to add the flour. So tip all your flour in and then we're going to mix it. Now it looks like it's lumpy, don't worry, this is absolutely fine. And this is what we call a roux, this is the base of any kind of creamy type sauce is to make a roux. And I'm slowly going to add my milk. Each time you add some, each time you add some milk, you need to stir it. Don't stop stirring, otherwise we will get big lumps in your sauce. So I don't know you can see, but my sauce is getting quite thick now. This is the kind of consistency where we need to now add some more, some more milk. So carefully just add a drop more milk and again keep mixing. So as you mix in you'll feel with the whisk you'll feel your sauce start to get thicker. Keep whisking it and start to add some more of your milk slowly a little bit at a time. Make sure you get around the edges of the pan as well because this is where the mixture will start and set at the edges of your pan. Don't let it get unset. This is this is where you just need to keep whisking it. So I just wanted to show you, we've now got a really nice pouring texture cheese sauce. And that is the perfect texture that we need, consistency. I'm just gonna add some black pepper to mine and some sea salt and give that a mix in so to turn it into a cheese sauce we're going to add a teaspoon of mustard powder or again like I said it can just be the ready made out of the jar and I'm going to add some cheese. Again, I'm going to slowly add the cheese because the cheese doesn't make your sauce thicker. But make sure you stir it in well. I always do it with a whisk. Some people do it with a spoon, but I prefer to do it with a whisk. I can feel the consistency of the sauce better with the whisk. So again, I'm going to add the rest of my cheese. As you can see, we've now got a lot thicker texture, and that's because we've put the cheese in, and the cheese makes your sauce a lot thicker. I'm just going to add a tiny touch of milk to mine. So that's a lot better, we've got a better consistency now. So 
that is how to make a basic bechamel sauce and then to make your cheese sauce just add your, your grated cheese and your mustard powder.